I did call and find out that what you described is true. Okay. Um, and I've just um, was able to get through to the deputy regional manager, Nurse Polito. Okay. Nurse Polito will be writing um, a full apology, regretting this inexcusable action and apologizing for any embarrassment that may have been caused on behalf of herself and the management of the hospital. Dr. Allen, I understand that there have been several complaints against uh, Nurse Polito and that uh, she has been apparently allowed to run amok in the San Ignacio Hospital. Well, I know that there have been several concerns raised about her management style um, and she is still within a probationary period for um, for this but she is a, a qualified healthcare professional um, working in a difficult environment and so but I know that the position uh, of all of our managers is subject to appraisal um, but I would um, um, I, I couldn't support the description that she has been allowed to run amok. I certainly don't think that's the case, but obviously there are some concerns which the ministry will take very seriously and will move to address as quickly as possible. Um, but apart from the general issues of administration, which we clearly have to look into, this particular incident is... Um, simply inexcusable. I mean, the, um, the idea of um, bringing in a police officer um, in such a situation, I, I really can't understand it. And in speaking to the deputy manager just now, she accepts that this was an inexcusable action, and she has undertaken to um, write a formal letter of apology to the uh, officer involved um, uh, and uh, apologizing for any embarrassment that may have been caused and assuring that nothing like this will ever occur again. The other issues about administration clearly we'll have to address separately. And uh, Dr. Rosado, is she allowed back uh, in the hospital? Well, that's the administrative issue that I um, have to um, find out more information about because the information that I have is that Dr. Rosado had resigned. So now I have to find out why Dr. Rosado is back at the hospital, and uh, that I will look into. I understand that the, the staff is now um, on sort of like a, a go slow. And they're not seeing patients as, as they were prior to this incident this morning? I have no information with that regards. Um, I've spoken to the regional manager and the director of health services. We believe that, as far as we're aware, services are restored at the hospital, but we will be making sure that um, we speak to the staff to resolve whatever issues are there and to make sure that the service to that community is provided as normal.